Jersey Sports Zone's high school football game of the week is brought to you by Ocean First Bank. Beautiful Ocean City is the host site for the first annual Battle at the Beach Showcase, and Saturday's lineup is headlined by a stellar public school battle. Syracuse commit LaQuint Allen leads his Millville Thunderbolts into battle against Rutgers commit Davison Igbenosin and the Union Farmers. This matchup is your Week Zero Ocean First Bank Game of the Week. Union drove over two hours to get to South Jersey, and there's no doubt they were warmed up. Matthew Nazaire handles the opening kickoff. He finds a crease and hits the lane. Nazaire gone, 85 yards to the crib. Union wasting no time. It's a 7-0 game immediately. But Millville settled in and they would find a rhythm. LaQuint Allen hits the edge with speed and picks up chunk yards. It's a 30-yard gain. The Thunderbolts get deep into the red zone all the way to the two. And that sets up Bryceer Hunter on the short touchdown run. He crosses the plane and ties the game. It's seven all midway through one quarter of action. Bryceer Hunter not done yet. Here he breaks through the line and blocks a punt. Special teams had a huge impact on this game and Hunter makes a big play. Millville takes over possession at the four, and then LaQuint Allen, another carry. This time, he finds Pater. The Thunderbolts get their first lead late in the first quarter. It's 14-7 Millville after one. Union opened the second quarter with a bang. The Farmers drove the field and fed Kwamir Brown from one yard out to score the tying touchdown. It's early in the second, and we're all knotted up at 14 all. Now we fast forward to the last minute of the first half. Millville wants to drive, but watch out. Davison Igbenosin strikes with the interception. It's a killer turnover for Millville, but it gives life to Union, and they immediately take a shot. Jaden Stewart rolls out, fires downfield for Lukenzie Jules, and he hauls it in. Jules with a big grab. Then Union goes back to the big man to finish it off. Brown has his second touchdown of the night. Union leads 21-14 on Millville as both teams go back to the locker rooms. Millville turns up the pressure in the third quarter. Union airmails a long snap on a fourth down punt and there to make a stop in the end zone, Bryceer Hunter. It's a safety for the Thunderbolts. Millville now trails 21-16 Seven minutes left in the third. So now, out on the field for the ensuing kickoff. And once again, Millville's special teams unit makes a special play. This is 14-year-old freshman Lazier Brooks, and he's off to the house. It's 65 yards untouched for the kick return touchdown. Two-point conversion good. Millville has scored 10 points in 10 seconds. They lead 24-21. Union always had a card in their sleeve, and the big plays went Davison Igbenosin's way. How about this? 35 yards on the pitch and catch. Union now has a first and goal at the five, and they hand it off to number five. Kendall Bournes with a touchdown. The seesaw action continues as the Farmers now control. It's 28-24 Union through three full quarters of play. Now, halfway through the fourth quarter, Millville desperate for a play, and check out this. Nate Robbins fires a bomb, Lazier Brooks hauls it in, and it's a track meet. That, folks, is elite speed. Robbins to Brooks, an 86-yard touchdown that blows the game wide open. After the big play, comes a replay. Millville now up 31-28 with six minutes, 23 seconds left in regulation. Union would try to put together at least a game tying drive late in the fourth quarter, but on this fourth and two, they don't convert. Millville's defense makes a late stand to force a turnover on downs. The Thunderbolts get the ball back with 2.43 on the clock, and they run it out to a victory. 31-28 is the final. No debate here. 
This one lived up to the hype and was the best game from all of Week 0 in New Jersey. LaQuint Allen tallied 113 yards and a score on the ground. But the star? Lazier Brooks. He put the state on notice with two dazzling touchdowns in his first game. As a team, Millville showed why they could have the firepower to light up South Jersey all season long. Man, it just says a lot about the maturity of our kids, the maturity of our coaching staff. Um, you know, hats off to the coaching staff, hats off to the players. You know, I mean, it, it says a whole lot in that, and this is going to build momentum to help us. Uh, we got a lot of leaders on our team. Got a lot of seniors on our team to lead these guys. I mean, one of your guys at our practice, you, you see that we practice hard every day in the heat. We just go after it. When we're down, coach yells at us. We don't say nothing back. We just do what we got to do. And that's what happened and showed out here tonight. Millville faces Mainland at home next week, while Union hits the road again for a big central matchup against St. Joseph Metuchen. Reporting from Ocean City, I'm Jay Cook with JerseySportsZone.com. South Jersey here, let's go! Yes, sir! Hey, sideline, let's clean up, guys.